Yes, I may be Wonder Woman, but don't make me whip you. Pch Hey there everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod review where today I'm going to be showcasing the Superheroes Unlimited mod which I have covered before and you can view that by clicking on your screen now or in the description below. But now we're in 1.5.2 and there are now 10 more superheroes to take a look at of which you can craft their suits and gain their powers. There's also a whole host of new weapons too so let's get straight into it and first off there's loads of ores but first off I want to mention that I'm not going to be covering the superheroes that I've already um, covered in my previous previous video so again if you want to check that out go to the description below and you can see that so first off lots of new ores there are a ton and all of these are going to be used to craft your superhero costumes and another note I'm not going to be going through all the crafting recipes because there's so many crafting recipes that I just want to get through all the powers and the suits and all that good stuff so do check the the forum post in the description below also to check out the extensive recipe book so let's go on to the ores and the first one is lightning stone this is used to craft stuff like flashes um outfit and uniform and and why do I call it that? I mean suit. And then we've got Black Iron, which is to do with Batman. Kryptonite with Superman. Amazonian Stone and Uru as well. Vibranium. Titanium. Adamantium, Ruby, Limonite, Purple Crystal, and Sapphire. And I think all of these look fairly cool. They're all kind of unique. I really like the Lightning Stone. And all of these are rare ores that spawn in your normal world. All of them are really awesome. And again, they're all used to craft your superhero suits. They all look cool and amazing. So yeah, really nice looking ores. And now we can move on to our superheroes. Now the first one we're going to look at is, I believe... Deadpool. Now, Deadpool is awesome, and this is how his suit looks. It looks kind of like an evil Spider-Man, so let's just drop this into here. And then we've got his weapons too, so let's, let's do this. Let's just let's don the suit. Let's put his suit right on here. And when you don the whole suit of a certain superhero, you will get a certain amount of abilities. So this one gives you speed and also regeneration as well. So when you get attacked by stuff, you will be able to um, regenerate, which is really awesome. I'm just going to change the, the game mode to day a second. There we go, that's better. And we can test out these awesome weapons. So let's just move this along a bit. And we've got two weapons for Deadpool. We've got Deadpool sword and pistol as well. So we're going to spawn a pig in. And oh my god, let's just go over this um, superhero strength first. First, we've got speed as well as uh, regeneration, which I've already mentioned. And this goes pretty fast. As you can see, this is me double sprinting. This is me normal sprinting. And it is pretty good. It is pretty damn good. So we're going to test out the gun and the sword here. This is a piggy. And we've got the damage indicators mod on to show us how much damage this will do. Deadpool sword does a massive 29 damage did you see that here we go this guy again 29 as you can see on the screen it pops up a little bit 29 damage is insane and we've also got the gun too which works as a normal kind of gun would you right click and it will shoot the piggy so this does about four damage a normal kind of arrow shot and you can't actually see where the bullet is going but i can assure you that it is definitely working so that one did six which is sweet i'm just going to test if it works better if you hold down the right click yes it does so it holds 16 there when i hold down the right click so here we go a normal shot does four and i'm just gonna hold it down a little bit longer and bam there we go a nice 16 shot there so really cool weapons and a really cool suit as well so let's take this off and we'll get on to the next superhero and obviously the kind of effects will carry on until they run out so let's just wait for them to run out and the next one is Wonder Woman. So yes, we are going to become Wonder Woman, what I've always wanted to do. And Wonder Woman has some cool things. She's got uh, a little bit of um, her head going on with the chest plate. And this is Wonder Woman's logo as well, which you can craft to make the chest plate. And she's got the lasso of truth. So let's put this on. We've got Wonder Woman. Oh my god, this is beautiful. So we've got Wonder Woman and this is what she looks like. Let me just um, go into... Oh yes, we are beautiful. She's pretty bulky, man. Oh my god. She's got the muscles going on. And this is the lasso of truth. We've got the spawn pig going on and she doesn't actually does she have yeah we go we've got some flying going on we don't have any kind of special abilities on the left hand side but if you hold in space you do get to kind of fly and you can just fly onto this mounting and act really awesome so what we're going to do is just go into this and she actually glides down as well and we're going to spawn into a pig and her lasso does 24 damage so it's definitely worth crafting and finding out how to craft because damn that's a lot of damage these are extremely powerful and wonder woman is going to be doing her work on you so let's get this off because we don't want to be a lady anymore and we'll put this back into the chest along with her logo and now we're on to aquaman who is awesome he's looking pretty sweet we've got his head we've got his chest plate which needs the belt nope the belt needs to be on the leggings and we've also got his aquaman's logo which is for the chest plate and his trident as well so let's grab all these let's don the suit and we look actually amazing oh my god all of these look so cool you can just turn into 
Oh my god, my beard is in my eyes, but damn, I look awesome. So what special effects have we got here? We've got speed four, is that? Yeah, that's four. We've got water breathing four as well. So his speed is pretty fast. Oh my god. This is me sprinting. This is me walking normally. It's awesome. It's cool. And this is the water breathing part. So we just jump into here. No, water man. Let's go into here. And we'll be able to breathe underwater forever. Obviously, I'm in creative mode. But in um, normal mode, you will be able to breathe underwater for an insane amount of time. And we're going to have a look at his trident too. So first off, we're going to look at the base damage. The base damage does a whopping 24 damage. So that is awesome. And you can also right click and spawn in a fish man. Yes, I, I, I kid you not, we have a fish man. I'm not sure whether he's going to help attack us. But yeah, he's interesting looking. And he's got he's ripped. So he's definitely going to be able to help you out. He's sweet. And the next one we're going to look at is Green Arrow. So Green Arrow suit looks like this. It looks nice and cool. And we've also got Green Arrow's bow. So let's just um, put all of this on. We don't get any special powers for this. We do look awesome though. The glasses are a little bit in the wrong place. But damn. Oh yes, look at that. We've got a moustache. Or is that just the helmet? But anyway, I'm just going to say it's a moustache. It looks sweet. And this is Green Arrow's bow. Um, I guess we can use it on a pig. I'm, I'm having trouble using this one to be fair. And there we go. It's just kind of like a normal bow. It doesn't do as much damage as the gun. I think um, Blood Pool is actually really, really good. So let's um, pull this back and see how much damage we can get on this ping. Stay still, sir. Stay still. Oh, yes. We've got 15 damage. So it's, it's a pretty good bow and awesome too. So it's awesome looking and you can become the green arrow. I think it's got a really high accuracy as well, just like the pistol. No, I don't want to put that back on. God damn it. So up next is one of my favorite ones from here, which is Thor. And Thor is looking sweet. We've got loads of metal stuff going on. And we've also got... You know what? I'm not going to pronounce this because I'll get loads of hate for it. It's just Thor's hammer. So what we're going to do here is have a look at what we get. We get speed and fire resistance. Very, very handy. And when you are um, wearing the suit and you've also got the um, hammer in your inventory, you can fly. So if you hold space, you'll just be able to fly like a boss, which is cool. And yes, it's all, this also has some special abilities. So let's get another pig up in here and we'll see how much damage the hammer does. Bam! Oh my, oh my god, that is an insane amount of damage. Damn, look at this. What, 54 damage? This is too powerful. You are too powerful, flower. You are too powerful. So let's um, also show the other feature of this, which I don't want to use on a pig. Actually, you know what? Let's do it. We're just going to right click. And we are able to spawn fire. And we're just going to be able to kill this piggy. Get out of here, son. Because he's going to cause a lot of damage. So we've got that. We've got the lightning. We've got the power. And that is Thor. He is amazing and awesome. I didn't see what he looked like. Ah, oh, yes. I am Thor. I have the beard. I'm definitely worth it. Worth it. So I'm next. We also have one of my other favorite superheroes, which is the Hulk. The Hulk is looking amazing, green, and just sweet as anything. And this armor is actually the most powerful armor in the game. It is almost impenetrable. So it's just insane. Look, oh my god. I am the Hulk. Do not mess with me, punks. I, I swear I will beat you up. So this is the Hulk. We get strength and speed, as you would imagine. And this is sweet. So what we're going to see is how much a punch will now deal to a pig. Oh my god, it deals 13 damage. Beware of my fists, everyone. So that is the Hulk. I think he can, yeah, he can jump really high as well, which is cool. And he doesn't take damage from falling. So that is the Hulk. He is impenetrable and he has the most powerful punch in the land. So up next is a very popular superhero, which is Captain America. And this is what it looks like. We've got his shield going on and we've also got his leggings, hat and all the good stuff too. And his logo, which is used for crafting. And this is what I look like. I look like an absolute incredible human being known as Captain America. Oh my god, this is sweet. I've got the wings on the side of my head. Everything is looking awesome. I can't use the shield properly right now. There we go. Oh, and Captain America. Hide behind my shield. So the shield is actually used as a weapon right now. It's not used for throwing just yet, but if you hit something with it, it does a measly nine damage, which isn't great, but in the future it will be able to be thrown, which is going to be awesome. So it does nine damage and can be thrown in the future. So what are we going to move on to next? I think we've got Robin next. And we also get speed for that as well. I didn't mention that. We get speed from Captain America too. So here we go. Robin. Robin is Batman's sidekick. As you all know, we've got Robin's um we've got Robin's tights, which is definitely a good thing. So let's put those on. We've got Robin's Oh my god, Robin's tights look super sexy on me so we've got robin ah oh, yes i like how you actually turn into the superhero rather than just ah oh, yeah look at this i am robin i have the quiff i have the tights so don't mess with me so we've got two weapons we've got the grappling hook and a battle staff so the grappling hook works pretty awesome you just throw it kind of like a snowball and wherever it lands you will be able to teleport to basically it kind of works like an ender pole, i guess without taking damage so that is the grappling hook and then we have the battle staff too which does a decent amount of damage it does about seven damage. Come here, you piece of 
because Robin isn't the best. We all know that. Robin isn't the best. We've got Batman for that. So we've got some really cool utility weapons and a nice glow stick for Robin as well. So let's take these off. And Robin doesn't have any magical powers either, as you would imagine. Poor Robin. Poor Robin. So now we're going to move on to Batgirl. And we can turn into another girl, which is sweet. And we've got Batgirl's grappling hook and the antidote pill. So let's put this on and see what kind of buffs we get. We don't get any buffs right now. We don't turn into... Um, we get a bit of hair at the back, which is interesting. So you grow hair. You get a cool outfit. And you also get Batgirl's grappling hook, which works exactly the same as Robin's. As... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I did not know you could do this. You can actually attach yourself to... Nope, nope. You can actually attach yourselves to walls. So that is incredible. So you fire it at a wall and you'll be able to cling to the wall. So that is awesome. Um, I'm not sure what you're going to do about getting off it, but that is Batgirl. And she's also got the antidote pill. And I'm not going to show this off just now, but it actually gives you regeneration if you eat it in survival mode. So that is really awesome. That is Batgirl. And our final superhero that I'm going to be showing off today is Nightwing. I believe is also from Batman. I'm not too sure because I'm only guessing because I'm not too familiar with this superhero, but they have similar weapons. So let's put this suit on, see what we get. We don't get anything and Nightwing's looking cool. I need to learn about this superhero. Damn. And he's also got the grappling hook going on, so we'll test that out. And we've also got the s screamer stick too. So let's throw this bad boy and actually travel really far as well. But you can't stick to walls it seems to be if you're nightwing so batgirl seems to be the only one that can do that or it's just to do with her grappling hook so that is that and then we'll see how much his stick does as well so bam it does a little bit less than robin so he's not as good but this is pretty cool feature if you hit n you actually get night vision so i'm going to test this apparently it's a little bit buggy so we need to watch out here so i'm just gonna change the time to um night over here and then press the n key Oh, yes, we do get it as well. Yes, we got night vision for 10 seconds. That is sweet, and that is Nightwing. So before I get on to the next chest, I'm just going to show off these two weapons. We've got the Kryptonite Sword and the Kryptonite Pickaxe. They are used with, um, used to craft with um, Kryptonite. So you can just um, mine Kryptonite and make these. They are very powerful, better than Diamond. And I'm just going to show you how much it does to this piggy here. It does about 12 damage per hit. So you craft it like a normal sword would, just with Kryptonite instead. And it is very powerful. So now that has been said, we need to move on to some pretty cool Batman gadgets. So this mod is nicknamed the Batman Update because lots of Batman stuff is in here. We've got the Batman. Batarang, Batman's Grappling Hook, the Bat Bomb, Sonic Bat Call, Smoke Pellet, Wing Ding, and Throwing Birds. Let's get all of these in here. And we will be able to use the Batarang. So the Batarang will do damage when thrown. It is a throwable weapon. And see how much damage it does. It does about 3 damage, but it is highly accurate. So where are you, son? Uh, 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 and you can spam them out pretty good as well. So when you've got enough um, of these out here, you can actually spam these. And damn, this is a pesky pig. Are you working for the Joker, huh? Are you working for the Joker? There we go. It takes a bit of a while to kill something. But yeah, they're pretty accurate and pretty speedy weapons too. And we've also got the grappling hook. You can't stick to the wall, so it seems like Catwoman is the only one that can do that. And then we need to move on to the throwing bird, which is Robin's kind of throwing weapon. And um, that's a bit more powerful than the um, Batarang, I think. So let's try this out. Yes, it's a little bit powerful. It does five damage instead to take um, a two hit on a pig instead. And we've also got the wing ding too. So I think this is, um, what's his name? What's his name? Nightwing's um, kind of batarang. So we'll do this. And that does six damage. So you definitely want one of these on your side. You want to be Nightwing. Nightwing is pretty sweet. So moving on. And we've also got um, the smoke pellet. And we've also got the sonic bat call and the bat bomb as well. So let's just move these out of here. And the smoke pellet is actually used on mobs. So you go up to it, you don't right click, you hit it with it and it will get affected with blindness and slowness too. So this pig is suffering right now. It's suffering a really bad death. So let's put it out of its misery by throwing a bat bomb at it. So as you can imagine, there we go. It's a batarang with a bomb effect. Get out of here, piggy. Oh my God. <laughs> that was sweet. That was beautiful. I'm sorry, Mr. Pig, but it was definitely, definitely worth it. So what we also have is the Sonic Bat Call, and this one is probably the most useless. I'm going to right-click the ground and show you what it does. Oh my god, it spawns bats. Are you kidding me? Yeah. There we go, bats galore. I'm not sure what they're gonna, what you're going to do with that, but hey, Batman has his company right here. So this, oh my god, there's too many bats right now. The squeaking, the squeaking. So those are all the Batman gadgets. They are really awesome. I just want to show off this Bat Bomb again. It's just really awesome. It's more accurate and has an exploding ability too. So let's just slow these in here. And we've got some more things to show you, which are the bosses. So I'm going to choose an outfit here. I'm actually going to choose Batman because um, why not? So yeah, that's pretty sweet. We've got Batman. We're going to we're gonna become Batman. So I'm just going to don the suit here. And oh yes, I am Batman because most of these are kind of Batman's um, villains. So let's do this. And oh my God, these bats are really 
frustrating me right now. Why did I spawn so many? But anyway, on to the bosses, and you have three different ones. We've got the Call of Fear, Kitty Got Claws, and Jokes on You. So we're going to grab these and grab a weapon as well. Let's go for some Batarangs, and we're going to use the Kryptonite Sword as well. So what we're going to do here is spawn in some of these bosses. So the Call of Fear will spawn in Scarecrow. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. What is going on here? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I've got blindness and night vision at the same time, which is severely glitching out right now. Um, um, let me try some milk. Oh, my God. This is bad. He's way too overpowered right now. So let me just milk this and see what happens. There we go. That's a lot better. Oh, damn. Night vision is stuck on me. So here is Scarecrow. That was a bit scary. I don't know why that happened. And Scarecrow will affect you with blindness. And when he hits you, he will also affect you with nausea. So let's get a bit closer to him. Um, I don't want him to affect me with blindness right now. There we go. Because it's glitching out. So there we go. This is Scarecrow. He kind of looks like a witch. And we're just going to take him out. He has 300 health, though. This is going to take a while. So I might just grab Thor's hammer and bash the crap out of him. So let's do that. Grab the old hammer here. And the Batarangs don't do much damage, so we're just gonna we're just gonna hit him. To get out of here, sir. So you can see how powerful this is. Um, hello, hello. I need some more milk here, sir. I don't know why this is happening. I think it's because it's glitched out and giving me night vision at the same time. Oh no, sir, stay away. God damn it. He was he was nasty, isn't he? So I'm just gonna finish him off with that so he will drop some stuff usually he will drop straw and his own scythe as well which is another cool weapon and that is scarecrow and hopefully it won't glitch out anymore because that was pretty scary so what we're going to be able to do now is call in our second boss which is kitty got claws spawn her in and it's catwoman of course it's catwoman now the only special ability she has is 350 hp which is incredible and she also has super speed so you'll be able to see that she has super speed and yes, we're just going to take her out. Zap her with lightning and all that good stuff. Oh my god, she's on fire. Unlucky Catwoman, you must die now. <laughs> so now we've got the most epic boss, which is the Joker. So here is the Joker. He has 550 health. And he's just... I don't think he has any special abilities right now. But yeah, we're going to set him on fire and take him out. So he can try and drop his rare drop, which is the Joker cards. So those are just joke. There we go. Here's the Joker cards. Now, I'm not sure if they do anything. Let's just try that out right now. Yeah, you can actually throw them. So let's see much, how, how much damage these do. And um, yeah, here we go. Here's a piggy. There we go. They deal six damage each, so they're pretty good. And that is what is dropped by the Joker. And I think... Oh, no. No, we've got some more to come. So we've got some actually other mobs that you have in this mod, which are different grades of prisoner. So we have the country prisoner. We also have the thug and the crook. Now, the Let's go. Um, let's go to the thug first. The thug is kind of like the smallest one, and this is what he looks like. He just spawns around the place. I think you've seen some in orange jackets running around. This is the thug. He won't spawn much. Um, he will drop a gun, and he will also drop gold as well. So these drop little bits of like robbery that they've had, and um, yeah, that is the thug. We've also got the crook, who looks like this. He's looking sweet. He's looking um, just amazing. Let's shoot him. Um, give me all your money. There we go. He's got 20 health as well, which is pretty big for a normal mob. And he will drop some of these special ores from this mod, which is definitely worth getting. Sapphire gems, I believe they are used to craft or go towards Superman's suit. That is awesome. And we've also got the count the country prisoner, sorry, that um, looks like this. He has a bit more health and he drops a bit better stuff. Just knock him out. And he's also got this, which is called um, Limonite, which is usually really hard to find. So they're all definitely worth killing. And they spawn randomly. As you can see, this guy is just chilling over here. And let's see if we can shoot him over here because I think the gun has 100% accuracy. Oh, yes. The gun is beautiful. So, yeah, a way to get weapons and an easier way to get ores to than mining. So, yes, I think that is pretty much what this mod has to offer. It's very extensive. There's five other superheroes, which, again, you can view in the description below or on your screen from earlier. And if you do like what you see and want to play it for yourself, which I'd highly recommend, then please go to the description below to check it out. Also, if you're new to the channel, then please hit that subscribe button for daily Minecraft videos. And for all of you, a like and a favorite would be greatly appreciated too. So thanks a lot for watching, guys. Do go check out this mod, especially if you are a Marvel or DC fan or just a fan of crazy good weapons. So thanks a lot for watching, guys, again, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye!